Hey guys, Shad here doing another box opening. Um, wanted to show you this is a backup power supply and also a surge protector with USB all in one. What's nice about this is if your power ever goes out and you're working on something right in the middle of building maybe a spreadsheet or programming, I do programming for a living, uh, you're not going to lose any of your data because the computer won't go off. It'll go, it'll still run for a while. In this case, it says right here 600. Um, volts 330 watts you can power up decent amount of items and they'll run for 67 minutes Well, usually all you need is a few minutes to be able to shut down. So I'm going to show you what this looks like inside Okay, we got this open we've got your instruction packet Sorry, it's taking longer than usual. Typical stuff here. Product registration, yada yada. Instruction packet. There's a USB B cable they give you. Don't know if I'll need that right away, but oh yeah, you will need that to power it. Okay, then you got here a uh, it's nice that they did the cable this way. I like it when they're flat and they go right up against the wall. That's a little bit thick of a profile though. It's too bad they couldn't have taken some of that off. But nonetheless, it's still, it's still nice to have it flat like that instead of the cord coming out. And then there's the supply itself. And right away it says, stop. Stop. I don't know what they're saying stop for. Stop, turn product over, remove rear cover. Okay, we'll do that. Relax. It's heavy, and to be expected, this is a battery, guys, right? Basically a battery here. Don't want to scratch my car. I'm doing this video on top of my car today. <clears throat> okay, there we go. So... There's the actual power supply. And there's the rear cover. And there's the battery. They're just indicating here you need to make sure you you connect it. Or you plug it in. A little tricky to get back in there. Oh, it's plugged in. I have to work that. Hold on a second. Okay. So you do need to put it in this way. And then this goes on this side over here. So cables this side where it won't fit. Now we're in, so that's easy enough. Then we got some uh, quality control stuff on the back here. And I won't take that off till I've used it and I make sure it works, but there it is. So it's got one little USB. So this goes to your computer. You know, it's a shame. They could have put maybe two or three, but I don't know how that would impact the power implications. But you'd think they could have put maybe another one on there. But you can uh, probably run this to a hub, but it's 1.5 amps, so I'm going to have to look into that. Um, but there you go, guys. You've got three, six, seven. 
These are battery and surge, and these are just surge. These are the protected receptacles. Hope that helps you guys if you're looking at this. It's the uh, APC. It's got a three-year warranty on it. And this is uh, the 600 330-watt version. So you can buy that anywhere, I guess. Hope that helps some of you guys. Talk to you later.